Sarah, Junie, hurry up, we're gonna be late. It's always rough being the middle kid, or as I like to say, the responsible one. <laughs> I mean, I had to be with six siblings. Mom was always doting on Sarah, and Junie was always trying to boss me around. But not today. Today, I had my new sash daddy bought me. And I know, I know, I'm not supposed to be boastful, but I can't wait to show it off at church. I know most kids dreaded Sunday school, but me, I was proud of my church. I know <clears throat> 16th Street Baptist was known far and wide. My church was famous, so in a way, it kind of made me famous too. I mean, Martin Luther King Jr. himself had been to our church earlier this year. We were the hottest thing in Birmingham since, well, since ever, and I got to go to Sunday school there. Sarah was always complaining about learning the Bible verses like Ephesians 4.32. Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as in Christ God forgave you. That's a good one for times like these. You see, Dr. King spoke about nonviolence and working together toward freedom and and, well, I just wanted to slug my sister for pushing me before we went into the church. Dad just laughed and ushered us inside, staying upstairs while us kids went down into the basement. Cynthia and Carol marveled at my dress with my new sash. Wow, Eddie Mae, where'd you get it? My daddy got it, I brag. Sarah's friend Denise shuffled over to see. We all giggled together while the choir overhead began to practice. But somehow, the sound became muffled and I think I heard a phone ring, and everything around me became still. The sound rushed away from everything, and then came back and grew to the loudest roar I had ever heard. And then, and then, and then it was quiet. Cynthia? Carol? Denise? Anyone? Mm -hmm. I watched and waited. I waited and watched. I watched as rubble was cleared. I watched as broken bodies were carried. I watched as Sarah cried from an eyeless face. I watched as tiny, lifeless forms were carried. Four of them, four children, mutilated and decapitated forms, one of which has a singed sash, my sash. Somehow, I was up in the air, overlooking the church, Overseeing my home, the screams and the wails carried upward to me, and I couldn't comfort them. I couldn't help them. Suddenly, I heard the giggles. Addie Mae, show us your sash. It was Cynthia and Carol and little Denise urging me onward towards the sky. Ryan Files for the second time.